Hey guys, it's your girl Vanessa here. Welcome back to another video. As I promised you guys, I was going to share what I have been using around my edges to help it regrow. Now, if you're interested, definitely want to keep on watching. Today's video is going to be this amazing hike of oil that has helped my edges grow back a lot quicker and also a lot thicker as well it contains only three main ingredients and trust me it is super super effective it will help you if you're suffering from alopecia not scarring alopecia guys or alopecia due to disease because you need to fix that first with scarring alopecia there's not really much you can do other than having a hair transplant but if you have hair loss experience maybe from doing tight hairstyles or postpartum shedding or I don't know for whatever reason your hair fell out apart from let's say being kind of like ill or having scarred alopecia this will help you a lot when it comes to regrowing your hair now I decided to include this clip here because I wanted to show you guys what my hair looked like just a couple of months after I had my son my hair was really full my edges were really full really popping and I was so in love with my hair but then a few months after that it literally started falling out and when I'm talking of postpartum shedding, if you guys have never experienced that, that's good. But for some of us that have had babies, this is our life, guys. And um, yeah, my hair was just shedding from the roots and my edges got so empty. I decided to include this um, screenshot of my camera roll just to show you guys the timeline. So this video was recorded on the 17th of February 2023 and this is what my edges were looking like so pretty empty as you can see and also the rest of my hair lost quite a bit of thickness because obviously it was shedding just so much now this is what my hair looks like at the end of march so it's only been what a month and a bit and look at how full my edges are looking already obviously we're still not quite there but it is it has improved tremendously and that is because of this oil that i have been using so i'm going to show you guys how to make it and also talk about how you can use it to see results in this way so i'll definitely suggest that you watch the video and you watch till the end so you can see exactly how to make it so to begin with as you can see here i'm going to use one fresh carrot now carrot is very very um, beneficial for our hair because it helps to promote high growth it also protects your your scalp from uv damage or free radical damage so it's really really good it contains vitamin a vitamin e both of which helps to improve the blood circulation to the scalp and that's why it helps in high growth essentially so I just grated my carrot so I'm gonna pop it in this little uh, pan here next I'm gonna go in with our next ingredient which will be some turmeric powder now if you got like you know the actual fresh turmeric that you can find in um, you know that like your regular Indian store please feel free to use that but I didn't have it and I've been using the powder guys because it's just easy for me to pop in my groceries local grocery store and find it um but you can get the actual turmeric um thingy from the from the shop uh the, the Indian shop so I added one table about one tablespoon of the turmeric uh, powder to this but again that's because that's the only bit that I had so if I had more I would have added more so I would suggest you use two to three tablespoons of turmeric powder for one kind of big carrot next I'm going in with some coconut oil so for those of you that are allergic to coconut oil leave this out completely and use another oil like um, avocado oil or just rapeseed oil just like I'm showing you guys here but I'm going to use both because I just love coconut oil on my hair and it has helped me a lot as well in my hair growth journey so I don't know exactly how much of this I added guys so add as much oil as you need to because you need to have like a good amount I'm going to show you the amount that I made um, in just a little bit so you want to add that to it and then pop the whole thing on the stove on a really low heat and just allow it to just do its thing so the carrot will dry up essentially um, as you continue to stir and that essentially will be when this uh, mixture will be ready so just keep looking at the state of your carrot just to make sure that um, 
it doesn't have any more water in it and then once that's completely done you want to turn off your stove allow it to cool down and then we're going to go ahead and strain it now this process can take a little bit of time so please be patient just because you know we're working with really low heat um but obviously the results will definitely be worth it in the end so just make sure that you are patient as you're working on it don't worry about the fact that it's foaming like this it's because of the um, turmeric powder that we've got in it but once you turn off the stove all that foam is going to go away and then you will have like a normal um oil not a foamy one essentially Now, once we've taken it off the stove, we're just going to allow it to just sit around and cool down and then we're going to go ahead and strain. So for this, I'm using a recap and that's just because it's easier, but use whatever you've got that works for you guys. Just notice how the carrots here have literally become darker in color and it sort of looks crispy as well. It was crispy. So that's what you want to get your oil like because essentially it will have no moisture in it and this oil can store in your house for as long as six to one six months to one year so um it's really good so something you can make a lot and then you know use continually if you want to so um yeah i just poured that on the recap and i'm just going to squeeze just to get uh, all of the oil out and then i'm going to dispose of the carrots but obviously if you have other uses for that please keep it and use it for um for that essentially now please remember you can also use essential oils like um, peppermint rosemary tea tree or even lavender essential oils now essential oils are great because they also help to improve the blood flow to scalp which just means it brings more oxygen and nutrients to your follicles which can help in promoting a new high growth so after straining it i'm just adding it to this mason jar and i'm going to be um, storing it in here like i said earlier because it has little to no water you can store this in the cool dry place of your house for up to a year without it like spoiling or anything and the way that i use this guys is just by applying it to my scalp so it's most importantly around my edges because that's what i was really trying to grow my hair from so i'll apply that and then make sure that i massage and then i will just tie my hair and go to sleep as i would normally i tend to normally do it at night because that's when i have a little bit of time for myself when all the kids are asleep and then i can focus a bit on me so just bear in mind that this does stain so make sure that your pillowcases are not white because yeah the turmeric does stain and um yeah just 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 be careful around that the other thing that you can do is after applying your uh, scarf you can just tie you know a little something around your edges again just to make sure it doesn't really pass through so that's how i was able to protect it so remember to use it twice to three times a week and also incorporate massages like i always say guys my scalp massages are great because they again it helps with the blood flow around the area and also um in stimulating new hair growth now also mind your diet so what you eat is also really important high protein foods are really good because our hair is made mainly of protein and that essentially just can help in high growth as well drink your water exercise these are the things that i have been doing not only to grow my hair guys but just generally to lose this baby weight and it has certainly been working so i hope that you guys will go ahead and try this out and um yeah if you find this video helpful please don't forget to thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you're not already and i will catch you guys in the next one thanks for watching until next time bye